Hi, I'm Rex Osborne, the President and CEO of More Than Talk LLC, and one of our companies is USA and California Safe Schools. Taking a couple minutes today to talk to you about what's happening in Pennsylvania today on the 9th of April. First of all, our hearts and prayers goes out to the students and faculty at that school facility, and that we're hoping that other schools are looking at what's happened and thinking about what risk are they at. Now, to prevent a stabbing or those kinds of incidents are very tough. Really, the key to it is, is anticipating, predicting what might happen. We encourage schools to have a good student threat assessment program. We have a program called Start Student Threat Assessment Resolution Team, and that's where we help people figure out before it happens, and they do it from see it, say it kind of things. We encourage schools to make sure that they have a team of professionals together that allows people to go ahead and if you hear a rumor, you hear a threat, you got an email, you got a Facebook, social media, whatever it is, bring it to someone's attention, part of the team. They'll evaluate it, look at it, and anticipate what is it that's taking place that's causing a student or even maybe a faculty member that could cause some red flags to go up before an incident takes place. Currently in Pennsylvania, I know that the FBI is on site and they're not there to investigate. They're there to help interview students and faculty and area community people to figure out what's the best way to see could this have been prevented through good strategic thinking. So get a hold of USA Safe Schools or California Safe Schools and talk to them about your student threat assessment programs. They're vital to success and safety is to have a good preventative program in place before a critical incident happens like what's happened in Pennsylvania. Again, I'm Rex Osborne from More Than Talk LLC, the parent company for California and USA Safe Schools. Go to our website for more information.